starting to see if this even works because I have I don't know if this is gonna work so if you guys are here hello let me know if you guys are here I'm also gonna check on my phone if if it works how are you guys how is everyone doing oh it works it works okay cool I'm gonna see I'm gonna I have my I'm gonna have my chat open on here so I'm gonna read that I need to charge it though how's the audio oh my god is the audio okay hello can you let me know how the how the audio is it sounds good okay if you guys hear like tinkling in the background i don't know if that's that's the right sound but if you guys hear like f flowing water in the background um i have like a cat fountain in the back sorry I'm heart 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 whoa thank you so much heart heart jenna hello jenna Hello, thank you so much for the sub, and Sarah, thank you as well. Um, yeah, so I have a cat fountain in the background. If that is annoying, let me know. I can put it in a different room or turn it off during the stream. Hello, everyone! Um, otherwise, yeah, I'm on my laptop. Um, that's why... I, I, you're so beautiful. Thank you, I appreciate it. Um, that's why the quality is a little different today. And also, it's a different setup. This is my living room. This is my couch. And this is Zuko. Oh, wait. I have to figure out how to do this. It's all reversed. This is Zuko. Say hi, Zuko. He doesn't want... He's shy. He's shy, guys. Um... Ooh, sorry, I need to quickly get my phone charger because I realized that my phone is low, but it's right next to me So give me one second. Give me one second chat. I'll be right back. Oh my goodness. Um, Happy 25 months gorgeous Thank you. Thank you for the sub. I don't know if you got You can probably hear that <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of that. I live on a really busy street So you guys are gonna be able to hear a lot of that. I don't know if you guys can hear the text-to-speech I can hear it. I don't know if you guys can hear. Can you guys hear the text to speech? This is not the new house yet. You can? Okay, perfect. Okay, perfect. 21 Thank you, Thank you. Love Thank you, you so much. Okay, yeah, this is still my old apartment. I can show it to you. Like these this is all the furniture that was already in the apartment. That's why like my living room is the only furnished room right now. Um I still do have a bed, <laughs> so I, I, I can still sleep because the bed was also pre-furnished. But this is, yeah, this is like still my old apartment. I'm not in the new apartment yet. Um, I am still, I'm still in the UK. I'm still chilling. Um, but yeah, I don't really have anything else. I just, that's why I'm on my laptop because I, I don't have my PC anymore. Anyways, what we're doing today is first of all, I'm gonna brush my hair because it, it looks really shiny, but I think that's the, the light because it's shining like right onto my head. That's why my, my hair is so shiny. I swear I just washed it. I literally just washed it. It is not greasy in case you think my hair is greasy. It is not. Um, what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna do my makeup and then we're gonna look at, at, the, new, at the new Liquid X Naruto. Um, Collection. I am so excited to come and meet you next yeah. weekend. But also yes, nervous, I'm gonna lots see you. Love, I'm gonna see three. you next weekend. That's fun. I'm excited for that. Um, will you do more TikTok lives? Yes, I will. This is kind of like the style of my TikTok lives. I don't know if you guys know my TikTok lives, but I'm just gonna chat and do my makeup while I do this. And then, like I said, I'm gonna look at these. Um, I'm really excited because obviously I've seen them before, but finally being able to hold the clothes in my hands and being able to wear the clothes that are because I really like the collection. I don't know if you guys have guys have seen the collection, but like it's really good. It's really nice. Like genuinely, even though this is obviously as you guys can see this is sponsored, I love the clothes. I love this collection. I um like myself um like like love them and i'm happy and that's why i love i love the fact that i can promote them so yeah we're gonna do that but first <gasps> thank you so much chaos historian for the subs i appreciate it thank you thank you i'm gonna do my makeup first and i actually um gonna start with my skincare because even though it is what time is it almost 9 p.m i have not done my skincare today because i had a really like intense day <laughs> so and I, like I, I was home all day so I, um, 
I didn't go out. I didn't. Well, I, I got this laptop, but otherwise, I I, I didn't. But I still had a really intense day because it's just been really stressful moving. Um, so I'm gonna start with my skincare. So I'm actually gonna walk you guys through my skincare and let me like tell you a little bit about my skincare. So I already washed my face. That's my first thing. I cleanse my face. With it. Thanks, May. If you hear like noises in the back, that's my cats. May has May has been on one. She's just been running around, but um. Yeah, I cleanse my face with like a um, a gentle cleanser. So like anything that, just, that says gentle, I like. I currently don't have the one that my um, uh, face doctor, I forgot what they're called. Zuko, he's playing with his toy. <laughs> um, what are they called? My dermatologist, yes. I currently don't have what my dermatologist um, recommended to me, but uh, he says like any f gentle cleanser will be okay because my skin is I think dry I have dry patches and I have like clogged pores that's mainly my skin and I do have some you can't see it on this on this um, camera but I do have some like hormonal acne I break out whenever I get my period and I also break out when I eat a lot of sugar so that's kind of about my face um, so I, I, I went to a dermatologist and they did like a face screening, they did like a UV like face thing and told me basically like what the concerns are. I do have a lot of sun damage as well because my, my skin is really, I have a sun allergy, like I have a UV allergy. So my skin is really um, uh, like not good with sun. So I have a lot of sun damage. Um, and because of that, um, they gave, they recommended me like a few products. So. Um, like I said, I, ha I have like a like a gentle cleanser as first, and then I already have uh, clean f clean fingers uh, to apply these. And I first so also so you guys know my skincare <gasps> goose house. Thank you so much for the gifted subs. I appreciate it. Oh my god, that's a lot of gifted subs. Thank you so much. What the hell? Thank you. Can we get some hearts in chat? Um, yeah. So that's uh, I my skincare is quite expensive. Just so you guys know, I do however not use much of it so it usually oh thanks see all the hearts that's so cute oh my god they're they're so cute also while i talk chat how are you i haven't asked how are you guys doing how is everyone doing um so yeah my skincare is quite expensive but i don't use much of it so it lasts me a really long time like it lasts me months and months um you're sick oh no you're good i'm glad i'm so glad to hear that what color is my hair? Currently it is like brown, like a, like a weird, my hair looks so greasy on this camera. I'm so insecure about that. Um, it's probably not good that I go through it with my hands all the time as well, but um, you are seeing Taylor Swift tonight? Let's go. That's gonna be fun. Um, but yeah, I, I don't use much of it. It is quite expensive, um, but I used to use The Ordinary and it honestly was fine for me. Uh, I just recently did the switch. Um, and I definitely do see a difference like I instantly can feel that my skin is nourished when I put these on but um, I'm sure you can find like dupes and things that will work for you that are similar as well um, but I will, I'll still walk you through mine in case you guys want to spend lots of money on skincare <laughs> I don't know it's a like I love skincare it's like a good like a nice like hobby for me so I don't mind spending much money on it but yeah, what I put on first is the CE Ferolic, um, whatever this is, from Skin Cuticles. And how I put it on, here you can see how like little I put on. I should put my hair back. Let me put my hair back. I'll show you how little I actually use of it. Um, so I use like two drops on each like on each of my what are they called cheeks on each cheek and it spreads quite a lot so I don't really need much of it just put it on this side of the face what hair care products do I use honestly hair care products I'm still not sure about like I use all of the um, Olaplex series like I use the like the hair mask and the shampoo and the conditioner and the aftercare, but I don't know if it's good for my hair yet. I haven't really 
honestly i haven't put too much effort into my hair <laughs> that's the main thing i feel like olaplex has worked for me but it's probably not the best um so yeah i honestly don't know i wish i knew though i think i'm i will definitely look into that more i don't use any like oils or any of that if that's what you're wondering um yeah and i'd put two drops on the other side and then that kind of like goes there and then i put three drops because i have a really big forehead so my <laughs> my dermatologist said i only will need like five drops but i feel like i have such a lot like i have so much surface i have such a big forehead so i need to use like three drops on my forehead alone i don't know <laughs> so you know i just put two drops uh, three drops on my forehead and then i do use i do put two drops on my what oh one thing that is really important is with the with this thing i don't know what it's called in english don't touch your fingers with, or your face with that because it can meow because <laughs> it can put uh bacteria into it and you don't want that that's one thing i learned um but yeah i just put that on my on my <laughs> meow <laughs> he's very talkative he loves to talk yeah i put that on my neck um and then <gasps> thank you thank you it's md for the sub i appreciate it um and then i wait for like a minute maybe even less for it all to like go, go in when did i pierce my lips i pierced them when did i pierce my lips like two months ago now probably was a while ago now wasn't it chat i think so Um, yeah. Um, like one month. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. <gasps> Brower, thank you so much for the gifted subs. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. One second, my Twitch just... Oh, my Twitch just stopped working. I can't see you guys. I can't see you. Let me see you. There you go. I can see you again. Okay, yeah, so I wait for a little bit to... Honestly, so my, my, my doctor just said, like, to wait, like, a few minutes. But I just wait, like, one minute maximum because I don't have patience. Um, and then I use this... It's also from Skin Cuticles. So I only use Skin Cuticles currently. What, what is... There's something on it. <laughs> there shouldn't be something on it. That's disgusting. Um, but um, it's the... Pyto A plus brightening treatment, and I don't know if I sh if I'm supposed to use this at night or at daytime, but I use it at daytime because I honestly forgot what he told me. Uh, he gave me like six products and was like, "This is your regime. Use it this way." And I forgot, Heineke. so I'm just using it in the morning, hoping that it's right. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I use that, and I use one pump, and I kind of just put it all over my face. There, 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 and then the rest I put on my neck are the cats coming to LA of course they are I would never leave the cats that's actually why I'm still here let me oh my god do you guys want to hear my moving story my nightmare of a moving story oh it is awful um that's why so I'm still here because of the cats I'm still here because the cats um May got her vaccine too late because she's still a baby and I was in LA when she was supposed to get her vaccine so she got it a week later and she has to wait I think two or three weeks to uh, for the vaccine to fully like have set in I think I don't know what it's called um, and because of that she had to wait one more week to be able to go to America um, so she's going on the fifth like they're both going on the fifth and that's when I'm flying over as well and then I'm flying back on the sixth for insomnia and then I'm going back on that Sunday so it's gonna be really busy but I promise you guys that I will go to, to insomnia so I am um but yeah the nightmare <laughs> the actual so wait I haven't told you this either okay there are so many every day there's just at least one thing that goes wrong and nothing that goes right I'm so glad I got the stream to work because with my luck I probably wouldn't have <laughs> but um so I, <laughs> I, where, where do I start? Yes, my movers came here on Tuesday, 
or Wednesday, on Wednesday. My movers came here on Wednesday morning and I had everything already packed up. I just wasn't allowed to close the boxes because for the um, border thing, they have to look, th like, look through boxes and know what's inside and make sure there's nothing inside that's not allowed. So I, um, so they came here, they repacked some boxes, they took some boxes, they took my um, desk, my office desk and like, I think that's all the furniture that they took. They didn't take any furniture because I don't have any furniture. Um, and then they left and I, I opened the door for them. I was like, thank you, thank you so much, blah, blah, blah. Uh, have a good day, blah, blah, blah. And then I close the door and the door doesn't shut. And I have like a door that just like falls shut because it like, it just, and then you have to lock it. So it, it doesn't even like lock. Um, and I was like, what is going on and I look at the door I look around the door and I realize that the um the door doesn't fit it doesn't fit into the door frame anymore and I was like how does this happen how does my door not fit into the door frame anymore what is going on um and <laughs> so I like I looked outside I was like what is like the hinges like there's st it's still attached to the hinges I don't know what's going on it's just like a huge gap at the top I think I have a video of it I, I was like I'm I am in, in in a film this is not real this is not happening right now I was like what is like there's no way this is actually happening how does my door not fit into the door frame that's so strange. I've never had that. I've never seen that before. Let me show you. There. Like, that's what happened. Like, uh, did you see that? It just didn't fit. It just didn't fit into the door frame anymore. And I was like, I, I was so, like, su like uh, surprised. <laughs> I know. Like, how does that happen? And so I called. No, I didn't call because I couldn't call. I couldn't call s I anyone either because my... Um, my phone data ran out so I was just there all alone in my apartment with an open door and nothing um, <laughs> thank you Nozomi for the 13 months um, and so I messaged my friends I messaged G and G was like uh, to talk to a task rabbit person and then I made a task rabbit account and a person came and they they had to like redo the hinge like one of the hinges was too old and apparently like from all the impact of the moving people going back and forth it like fell off um and so he did that and then luckily that worked but like even before that like e like ever since four months Nihachi a month love. ago thank you Gina uh, for the sub like every day something has been happening now I can't pay my apartment's deposit because in America, they take a weird payment Ooh, that they months. don't do in Germany, and my account, my bank account is German, so I have to, when I'm there, like fix all of that within one day because I'm leaving again over the weekend, and I can't like just have my cats because I'm going there with my cats, so I'm stressed yeah, about that now. Can. So like, there's just like every day there's something, you know. Luckily, I made, I got the movers now. I have to send them some more information, but that's all good. Um, <laughs> but yeah. That's what's going on with me. Anyways, next I do sunscreen. And one thing that my dermatologist told me about sunscreen that might be interesting for you guys as well is that you should use a like 100% mineral sunscreen because the other ones, I used this one before, it clogs your pores. Um, and he said like even like 50% mineral ones, they clog your pores. There are not many 100% mineral ones, but if you can and if you find them um, and you were scared about clogged pores, um, he told me, I don't know if that's the, how real it is, but he told me that um, it will clog your pores. So that's why I use 100% mineral one. And what I do with this one, because again, it's really small and it's like not much. I also dot them around my face. I use bigger dots, like, I use more sunscreen on my, <clears throat> on my face than I use any other skincare things, because I think sunscreen, honestly, out of everything, sunscreen is probably the most important thing, like, out of skincare, if you don't want to use any skincare products, at least use sunscreen, um, because it can, like, sun and UV, like, seriously can damage your skin, and as a person that's really, um, like, it has a lot of problems with it. I know how much and how quick it can damage my skin. 
So I use a lot more sunscreen on my face than I use anything else. Is it sticky? No, it's not. It's like really hydrating. Um, I used to hate, I used to hate the texture of sunscreen. I used to hate wearing sunscreen. Um, and I like, I'm, I'm better now and I don't really care now, but I still know the feeling of like why I hate sunscreen. This is like really lightweight. Um, also, this is not sponsored in case you like, in case you care. This is just my personal experience and what my doctor told me. <laughs> um, you're the per first streamer I ever subbed to. Oh my god, thank you so much. Now you have the little Zuko badge. The little Zuko badge with a with a butterfly. God, isn't my forehead just huge? So, and then what I do with um, my my neck, because this is so expensive and because this is like so little, um, and I still have my old sunscreen and I hate wasting things, I just use my old sunscreen for my neck because I don't really care about my pores being blocked on my neck. I never had issues with my neck, like I never had any like spots or anything on my neck. So I just use... <gasps> you look really cute, thank you. I don't feel cute. I feel like my hair is just not herring right now. You know, you know when your hair is just not herring? Um, yeah, so I use my old sunscreen on my neck. Yeah. <clears throat> That's pretty much what I do. And now on to make, not just a hair day, yeah. It's just not a hair day today. Even though, it's because I just washed it. Whenever I wash my hair, it just doesn't sit right. Yeah, all right, that's my skincare. That's what I do in the morning. It's not morning right now, but I thought I'd still show you. And also I haven't done it. Um, so onto my makeup. I, ha I already have everything in bags. By the way, this is purple shampoo. My purple shampoo, and I don't learn because it happened to me multiple times. My purple shampoo like exploded in my suitcase. My um, small suitcase is full with purple shampoo. And again, I don't learn because this happened like three times. Um, so everything also is purple now. <laughs> That's just my life. <laughs> I just have everything purple now. Everything has purple, like, sponges, bitches. I don't know what it's called. Purple blobs. But yeah, let me get up my, my makeup. I haven't updated my makeup routine at all. So if you guys have seen my makeup before, I'm doing exactly that again. Hi, Nikki. But Hope it might still be interesting. Haha. Less Thank than you, three. Moon, for, oh, moon, out for the two months. I appreciate it. Thank you. I hope your luck improves. Thank you. I hope so as well. <laughs> I really hope so. I feel like I probably at some point used up all my luck and it's like recharging now. <laughs> I don't fully believe in that, but it, it it makes me feel better because it has to go it has to go up, right? There has to be something something good <laughs> at some point, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> anyways um i don't currently use um i'm also doing my stream makeup so my stream and day-to-day -day makeup but they're both different but i'm gonna do my stream makeup today because i'm filming a tiktok afterwards by the way yeah um i'm gonna try these on on tiktok later so if you guys want to see them tried on go on my tiktok after the stream but i'm filming that after the stream because i want to unbox them um on camera but yeah um I wanted to tell you about the nightmare, the, just the nightmare of moving, like moving has just been a nightmare. Um, I luckily, so when I got, <laughs> that's also a funny thing, I don't know if I told you that, but um, my cats, because I have to like, you know, I have to go through like all the customs and an agency to get my cats over, um, and May is still really young, it has been really difficult to get her over. I got her vaccine and I was like, I, I knew I had to go a week later and that was fine. And then I, um, <laughs> there she is, oh my God. <laughs> and I, um, I emailed the agent and I was like, May just got her vaccine, here are all the infos. And then the agent was like, okay, can you give us her microchip number? And I was like, she doesn't have a microchip number. Suko has a microchip number because he's older and he's, what is it, spade? Um, but she doesn't because she's still a baby and I wanted to get her the microchip when she was getting neutered. Um, and she, and, and the lady was like, she can't go, she can't travel without a microchip. Um, and I was like, oh, well, 
I wish you would have told me that sooner when I actually asked you if she can go without um, a microchip and you said yes, she, she can. Um, <laughs> but um, I, I could not I could not get it out of her. I was like I was like, is there anything else I can do? I don't know when, like I literally I have like one week left or two weeks left at this point. Um, I, I, I don't really want to call the vet again <laughs> and, and, and go there again because I was there yesterday and she was like, no, she needs a microchip. So I called up the vet and I was like, hey, remember me from yesterday? Uh, I have to get get my cat again to the vet because she needs a net microchip number. Um, so, and, and the lady was like, okay, sure, when do you need it? And I was like, as soon as possible. And the lady was like, can you come now? So um, poor May had to go to the vet twice, twice in a row because she needed a microchip and I didn't know that and I wish I did that before because she was really mad at me afterwards. She's not mad anymore. I think she forgot about it. But yeah, that that's the story of how I may, may have to go to the vet twice. And then also, um, what else? There are so many things. Oh yeah, my moving company. Um, I, I, oh, by the way, <laughs> hey, can you not? She attacks him and she's like really aggressive with him. So sometimes he hisses at her um, to tell her off, but otherwise they love each other. I swear, I swear to God, they love each other. Um, but yeah, so um, the moving company, I did all of this a month ago, like, like because I knew this was gonna take ages, but I thought if I get this over as soon as possible, it'll be nice. Um, the agency, when I when I messaged them first, I told them everything I have and everything I need, and they called me on Zoom and I showed them my apartment and I showed them everything I'm taking so they could make it do a quote and stuff. And on the sixth on the sixth of this month, I paid them for the first time and I paid them a huge amount. By the way, I'm like skipping my brain's like skipping back and forth because. Like there has been so much I had to think about, just so you know, that's why I'm talking like this. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking really confusing right now, but it's just because my brain's skipping back and forth. Um, anyways, so I, I paid them on the 6th of this month and they came back to me a week later and were like, we didn't, we didn't receive your payment. And I was like, what do you mean you didn't receive my payment? Here's a screenshot of me paying you and the payment going off of my bank account with all of your data, like correctly. And they were like, no, sorry, we talked to the finance like people we don't have we don't have your payment you need to call your bank and get your money back so i had to call my bank get my money back um and pay them again and it didn't go through again and i was i like i, pay, I tried to pay them with my credit card and it didn't go through and i was like what well, this is awful what is going on so i called my bank and my bank was like yeah it's because um it's too much money <laughs> like your daily limit is exceeded and that was just the card the other payment i did through like bank transfer and it should have worked it just didn't i don't know why um so I paid them twice, and then um, when they received that payment, I emailed them again, and I was like, can you please confirm that you are um, coming over in like three days because the payment is through now, and I need you guys to come over, and they just ghosted me. And I was like, fuck, I got scammed. Like, I got scammed hard. I had to pay twice. I paid like eight grand to these people. I got scammed. Um, and then I emailed them again, the day before it was like hey guys um i haven't received an email yet that you guys are coming over can you guys please confirm that you're coming over and i still didn't get an answer and i was like fuck i actually got scammed i'm gonna sit here where's my powder oh i lost my powder let me take you guys with me to get my powder real quick um and I was like, I was like, shit, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna sit here tomorrow with no movers, um, with full furniture, and it has to go to a different country over this, the ocean, what am I supposed to do, what am I gonna do? Um, and so I called them, and they were like, oh yeah, 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 we'll be there tomorrow, we'll come there tomorrow, don't worry, like, as if nothing ever happened, where's my powder? <sighs> oh, there it is, it's on the ground. Um, because I do my makeup in, in the mirror. <laughs> oh, look, it's me. It's me from the back. It's you, chat. Oh, my God. Wait, I can show you guys. You guys. That's fun. Um, but, yeah, so I... So they they were like, like oh, yeah, yeah, we'll be there tomorrow. As if, as if it was the most normal thing ever. Um, so that was fun. That was not a shock at all. And I loved that. 
Um, <laughs> so that was another thing. They're just like these these small things that add up, you know, like if it was one thing um, that just doesn't work out, I'd be like, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> it's moving. Moving is always stressful. But there was just one thing after the other every single day. And now I'm going there in a week and I still don't know how to pay my deposit, <laughs> but I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out when I'm there because that's what I do. Uh, anyways, I'm going to put on some, oh, it has bits in it. That's disgusting. Uh, it's henna. It has bits of henna in it that I'm gonna put on some Vaseline. I usually just scrape around it. That's really disgusting. I need to get a new <laughs> need to get a new lip balm. But I don't like wasting things. So thank you, Sebastian, for the twelve, 12 months. months. I appreciate it. Hope thank you. you thank you. Had a nice day, Nikki. Smile. Why didn't I sue them? Cause I needed them. I didn't sue them because I need them because I have to move. And they're the only company that was willing to move me. <laughs> so I I had to. I couldn't. If I would have caused a scene, even with the door, like people were like, my friends were like, you know, you can just get your money back. And I was like, but what if they just lose my stuff? Like, I'd rather not. With my luck right now, I'd rather just leave it as if nothing ever happened. Um, other than, uh, like, instead of them losing my stuff, you know? I can't do that. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's, that's that. <laughs> that's my nightmare. That's what is currently going on. Anyways, chat, how are you guys doing? I'm currently on powder. I put on some foundation, which is the NYX, where is it? NYX Photo... G studio photogenic concealer Cor concealer Cor concealer corrector sorry hd concealer in porcelain that's what i that's what i put on the por in porcelain and then i put on the nyx can't stop won't stop in i think 03 it doesn't really say but it's also like really light because <laughs> i'm pasty yay I like, like, there's no difference. There's no difference between these colors. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Let's hope that when I move to LA, I get, I can't, I can't get a tan because I can't tan. I can't go into the sun. I have to wear sunscreen. So maybe I will never get tan. That's fine. I guess. That's my life. Mmm. I'm just pale. It's hashtag German things. Oh, chat. I redownloaded TikTok um, just now while I don't have anything else to do because I can't really, I don't have a PC or anything. So I redownloaded TikTok and I keep getting German TikToks. And I have to say, like, German people are funny. <laughs> like, the German TikToks I get, they're really funny. They're hilarious. I get, like, cats and then I get, like, German people just, like, doing the most random things and talking like funny <laughs> i don't know german tiktoks are really funny english tiktoks are the least funny it's least funny i said it how are the french tiktoks cory a french tiktok's funny as well there are some funny oh my god do you guys want to see my favorite tiktok wait wait Oh, I forgot to charge my phone. <laughs> I got my phone charger. I forgot to charge it. Also, look at that. It's full with cat bites. It's because May likes to bite things. Let me show you my favorite. It's English, so... Um, just so you guys... Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Wait, this is not my favorite TikTok, but I just saw... Like, I just like this. Nothing Nowhere is going on tour, and they're also releasing the next album soon. <laughs> oh, God, it's loud. Wait, you can't hear it, can you? Wait, I need to put up my, I need to put my headphones up. There you go. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait. <laughs> it's so funny for no reason. But that's not the funny one. That's not the one I wanted to show you guys. The one I wanted to show you guys is. <laughs> further uh, down. it's so funny i was like i was laying in my bed and i scrolled 
to TikTok and I saw that and I was laughing for like five minutes straight. It's so funny. Um, <laughs> wait, where is it? God, I have so many like TikToks. Um, no, I can't find it. I'm always scared that they get deleted as well. I want to do a stream where I show you my favorite TikToks. Um, oh no, I can't find it. I thought it was around this time, but it's not. It's honestly, it's so stupid. It's just two girls. I don't know, maybe you guys have seen it. It's two girls in like an attic and they, um, they like spin around. Like one of them holds the camera and one of them spins around and then the other one holds the camera and the other one spins around and she hits her head and it's just really funny for no reason because it's like something that I would do and I think it's really funny but I don't know I couldn't find it <laughs> but it's it's my favorite TikTok <laughs> you've seen it yeah because yeah it, it's like a cutoff as well because the other girls are just laughing okay I'm also doing my makeup on this the screen like I see as much as you guys I don't have a mirror so just so you guys know what I do next is bronzer I I have a I, most most things I use is either NYX or Colourpop um so yeah my next one is the the NYX matte bronzer and I put that on my cheekbones well under my cheekbones under my cheekbones <laughs> yeah I wish I could show you there are like a lot of TikToks that I, that I want to show you though, because they're funny. <clears throat> I also got boba. I haven't opened it yet because I got it before I got my, I, I bought this laptop literally today, by the way, in case you, in case I didn't say yet. I bought this laptop today because um, I, I needed something to stream on <laughs> so i bought this laptop um but yeah, i got boba and i haven't opened it yet it was in the fridge until before the stream so i'm gonna open that and drink some boba it's um matcha espresso like matcha with coffee and it sounds pretty interesting i like my coffee and i like my matcha so i'm gonna try that someone asked what happened to toff toff is with rihanna now because it was rihanna's cat so she's with rihanna now Can you give some makeup? Wait, can you give some makeup doing this? You mean some tips? Some makeup tips? I don't know. <clears throat> I feel like... Thank you, Alfie, for the sub. I appreciate it. Hi, Nikki. I've been having a chronic pain flare-up recently. Oh, no. So your stream so is a really nice distraction and comfort. I hope you feel better Thanks soon. for everything you do. Less than Thank three. Thank you. I'm sorry to hear that. Um, Some makeup tips. I think... I think one thing that I kind of learned throughout the years is that like stage or on camera makeup is different than day to day makeup. So a lot of the times when I go out like and just do a day to day makeup, I don't wear this much makeup. Like I don't put makeup, I don't put like foundation on my face at all. And then I only wear concealer to conceal, like, to put, like, under my eyes and, like, where I usually put it and, like, to put, like, on the places that I need to, like, conceal things. Um, <laughs> yeah, Zuku is here. Wait. <laughs> he looks so angry. Why do you look so angry? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. He looks so angry. <laughs> I, I can't touch him because he doesn't like the smell of makeup um so yeah i put like a lot like I, I like exaggerate my makeup um for my camera makeup basically <laughs> pissed he always looks like this though he just has the, the he has the look he's either constantly angry or constantly um confused that that's the two looks that's the two looks of zuko <clears throat> Right, baby. Right, little baby bird. Yeah. Yeah. He's so cute. He's such a cutie. <laughs> thank you. Um, Cry was taken for the prime. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. 
Um, yeah, but I don't know. Um, a lot of t- a lot of the times I get asked how I do my eyeliner about people uh, from people. And one thing that I say, I always say, is um, try and find the shape for your eyes, and like try and like figure out what you want to do with your eyeliner. Like I try to make my eyes longer, like. I don't know if that makes sense. Like I try to, I try to put a lot of emphasis on my eyes when I put my eyeliner on, um, because that's like my staple thing, Um, and I like my eyes. My eyes are the one thing I always would get compliments growing up, so I I like to emphasize my eyes. But some people don't. Some people want to put more emphasis on their lips, for example, and like with that they might want to have like a smaller eyeliner or something like that. You know, like you have to like figure out what you want to do with your eyes by the way the only thing i need uh, a mirror for is my eyeliner so let me (laughs) let me let me do that with my phone um so yeah yeah that's kind of what i would say my eyeliner is really dried out at this point i need a new one um Um, and what I use is the NYX Epic Wear, um, but it's not nothing I would recommend to beginners. Um, for the beginners, I would recommend the NYX Epic Ink Liner because it's easier to use, um, and it's not as like waterproof. <laughs> like it's you can uh, get rid of your mistakes with that one. This one is harder to remove. I already did a mistake, as you can see there, but that's okay. I'll just wait for it to dry, and then I get rid of it. I need to concentrate for this, I'm sorry. I'm like quiet with this one. And what I do with my eyeliner, if you can see it, I don't pull it into the crease, like into the, is it the crease? No, not the crease, into the like tip of my eyes. I kind of stop where my eyelashes or like my big eyelashes would stop. Um, yeah. Thank you, Varagorn, for the sub, I appreciate it. May, what are you doing? Oh, why were you in the kitchen? She just jumped in front of me. She scared me. Hello, baby. Do you want to say hi to the chat? You want to say hi? Look, there she is. Little baby. Little baby. Come here. Oh, Oh, little baby. Little baby. (laughs) And then you were like, why am I not the little baby? You're always the little baby. But I have stinky hands. You don't like the smell. Okay. Um, anyways, that is my eyeliner. That's as much as I can figure it out without a mirror, I think. Hello! Look, look who's here. <laughs> oh, no, baby. She, she doesn't meow, she just opens her mouth. <laughs> um she screams though like she she's a mancoon and mancoons are very vocal she definitely is very vocal but um only when she wants to be <clears throat> okay next is, next thing i do is my mascara um and i only put it on my top lashes and it kind of like automatically goes onto my bottom lashes so there is a little bit of mascara on my bottom lashes always but i try to only put it on my top lashes Thank you, Artsabi, for the 18 months. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I hope you're doing well. It's nice to see so many people here. <clears throat> she only goes, ah, yeah, she does. You can hear like a little like when she does it. Obviously, I did it louder than she would do it. But yeah, otherwise, you can't really hear her meow. Um, sometimes what I like to do is, especially on stream, I've 
not really been doing it off stream much but i i did it at first is i like to put some um mascara oh i forgot not mascara some eye eyeshadow um i forgot to do my eyebrows um i like to do some eyeshadow under my eyes so it's kind of like like a like more eyeliner but again i don't put it too much into the eye i just put it kind of on the side like that you can't really see it too much on this uh camera but it's the idea that counts am i right chat so yeah it's kind of i kind of do that um again oh sorry i'm, I'm sorry you guys probably want to see zuko <laughs> um which color it's like oh yeah i forgot to show you so this is the revolution makeup shadow pa palette shadow palette i got it from uh i think super drug at, at Har halloween i did it i got it for the red because i used that for my devil costume but yeah i use this one so if you go this this one and that one i use for my eyebrows um because i they're, they've grown now but i cut the ends of my eyebrows off because i am really easily influenced by tiktok um and they did look really good but they've they've grown since so they're now they're now grown again so i don't really need to do them but usually i just i just use like this angle oh my god what happened i use like this angled brush and i just like kind of make it more straight but now i can't really do that because they've grown back <clears throat> Oh, the mascara is ColourPop's um, collab with, oh no, ColourPop Volumizing Mascara. They sent it to me. Um, it's not my favorite, I'm going to be honest. Um, I do really like it because I really like ColourPop and they, I, I, I've never really seen a product by ColourPop that's not good. So it's good, but I don't prefer it. I used, I used to use the maybelline one the not waterproof but i forgot what it was called um but i don't again i don't was like wasting things so i'm using this one right now um i want to cut my eyebrows but i'm afraid to i mean should i do it now should i do it right now so you guys are not afraid of it i would need a mirror for it though um i could get a mirror well, I could go to a mirror. Yeah, I'll do it right now. So you guys don't have to be to to show you guys that you don't have to be afraid of it. Let me uh, let me let me go. Let's go chat. Let's go into my bedroom where I have a mirror. There we go. Where are my razors? I got some new ones today because the other ones were rusty, but I don't know where I put them. Oh, I, I know. I haven't taken them. Haven't taken them out of the packaging yet. But I don't want to dox myself. That would be. I mean, I'm moving next week anyway, so I could just dox myself. But I, I would prefer not to. some razors i just got like random ones off amazon i don't know which ones are good but let's just get this um oh, how what do i do how do i put my my laptop i don't really have anything to put my laptop on actually maybe i have a box like that and then you see the mirror here i don't know that's the best i can do actually maybe i can put you in front Ugh, let me let me try that um just got my first tattoo the other day in the aftercare tips don't scratch it i'm i'm here from above to show superiority don't don't scratch it no i'm just doing that because my box is too small <laughs> um okay I'm just, i'll just i hope you can't see any boogers i hope i don't have any boogers because i'm gonna have to look up but you guys can see my nose and now you're gonna look at it please don't look at my boogers if i have any boogers 
I'll be embarrassed. <laughs> okay. Um, so yeah, what I do is I just, I, you know where it like goes down? You can't really see it too much on camera, but where that goes down, I just shave that off. Should have probably done that when I didn't have makeup on, but you know, that's fine. There we go. Shave some under it as well. I know a lot of people go in like a lot. I don't really like going in too much because I'm not the most skilled person when it comes to doing eyebrows because I've never done them. So I kind of just like to um, leave as much as I can. Long brows with me too. Thank you. I just like to have the freedom of doing whatever I want with them. Oh, she's using a bathroom. I thought she was doing climbs. You broke your wrist today? No, I hope you feel better soon. What has been my experience with the snake bites? I really want them, but I'm very unsure. So I do really like them. Like I've wanted them since I was a really, like since I was like 11. Um, but they can get annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Like sometimes I do get annoyed by them. I don't regret them, but I'm like, oh man, you know, like, uh, like the ones I have in right now, they're pretty cool, but they keep like going up like this and I wake up like this and I'm like what the hell man <laughs> it's so annoying but I don't know I do like them they can get annoying though because they're in your face like they're in your mouth like nose piercings you don't really feel because they're not really in your mouth but these are like they are in your mouth you can you know you do feel them you don't bite them like people I think a lot of people are afraid of them because they're afraid of biting them or like hurting their teeth with them. I've not really had that problem, not really had that experience. I, of course, when I got when I first got them, I didn't really know how to eat. I would bite them. Um, and also they were bigger than they were supposed to because of the swelling. Um, but once I changed them, um, I, I, it, it, it was fine. So yeah, you know, that's kind of my experience. So you definitely should think about it like, do you get annoyed by things in your face easily? Snake bites probably aren't the, the thing. <laughs> That's sadly how it is. <clears throat> what do you think of an angel bite piercing? I don't know what an angel bite piercing is. Let me, let me check. Let me check what an, what an angel bite is. Angel bite piercing. Oh, it's the, it's it's the top ones, that the I think they're, I I've seen people who can really pull them off, but I've also seen people who it where it looks goofy on them. I think it really depends on people. They're cool though. I do think they're really cool. I do think they have something. I've never seen them before TikTok. But, I think they're cool. I wouldn't get them though, cause now I have my snake bites. I feel like it would be too crowded. Come on, why is this not, some of this, some of my hair, I don't know if you can see that, it's just not going, going off. Is it because the razor isn't sharp enough? Like that, maybe. My, my eyebrows also are not, like, friends. <laughs> like, this one is a lot higher than this one, as you can see. But, you know, that's life. I can hide it, and also I'll... I'll fix it with makeup. Um, should I get my makeup real quick and fix it on the mirror? Hi, Nikki. So you guys can I see hope it. you're having yeah. an amazing day. Thank you. I hope you do as well. Starbucks. A Starbucks. Starry Bucks. Let me quickly get my makeup. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to butcher your name. There we go. Hello, hello. <laughs> Starbucks. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, let me let me show you what I do with my with my little makeup. I'm again, I'm such a like I'm really new to doing eyebrows because I never I've always had eyebrows. Like I've always had like darker eyebrows that are not like 
like too thin and stuff like I've, I've always quite liked my eyebrow shape so i've never really done anything with my eyebrows so this is very new to me so i, I don't really have any eyebrow products so i use eyeshadow <laughs> and the makeup girlies are probably gonna be mad at me but i don't have anything else and i don't know what to use and how to use it so if you're mad at me show me how to do it <laughs> anyways i use eyeshadow and then i just like kind of just like elongate like i, I go more up than, than i should and kind of just make the whole thing longer like that oh my hair is annoying like that and then i blend it in with my normal eyebrows and that's what i do and that's my eyebrow done i like it to be sharp like my eye like my eye i i i uh no not mascara why am i eye, eyeliner <laughs> why can i not speak right now what is going on today i just can't speak today um, but yeah, so the next, the other side, I do the same. I need more. Oh, I got a message. There we go. There we go, and that's my my eye eye brows Hello, done. Hope you are well. So much we eye things. Thank you, thank you for the sub, and I hope you're well as well. <laughs> Look at me! Look at her! Hello! What are you doing up there, huh? Committing crimes? Committing crimes? Is that what you're doing? Alright, let's go back to my living room. Because otherwise I'm looking down on you guys and I don't like that. <clears throat> so let's, let's go back. Look, look, look. May's gonna follow, don't worry. She doesn't like being alone. Yo, we used to talk a bit like two years ago. I'm good friends with David. If you remember him, ah ha ha. I still get bullied for an edit I made you when I first found you, lol. I hope everything is going well. Thank you. If you want to play some Valorant I think I do sometime, remember. let me know. I remember David. Thank you. <clears throat> okay. So that is. That's basically my, oh, I, have, I have cramps chat again. It's basically my makeup done. I just put on some lipstick as well. Not too much. I, I like kind of tap it just to give it the color. But when you like drink or eat and you have like full lipstick on and it like fades, it looks a little weird. So um, I don't really do that. And then I put on some setting spray. And that's it. That's my makeup. And I'm gonna brush my hair again because I'm really insecure about it today. Haha. <laughs> um, so yeah, that is that. I hope that could help you a little bit. What lipstick? This is also a ColourPop one. Um, they sent it to me as well. It's called What Up. Um, it's a cream lipstick. In this color i like it a little darker than this is but i don't I, I already packed all of them and this is the only one that stayed i accidentally just left this one so this is the one i'm using currently um my favorite lipstick is uh, nyx liquid lipstick in cabaret show and it seems like they don't produce that anymore so i've just been trying to find a similar lip shape shape shade but I couldn't find the right one yet. Should I put on some dry shampoo? I'm gonna put on some dry shampoo because my hair, it, like the the lighting just makes my hair look really greasy. So I'm gonna put on some dry shampoo. If I can find it. Uh, one second, chat. There we go, this should be better. Is this better? Yeah, it's better. Cool. Um, all right, should we open the box? Open the box chat. How do I do that? Let me let me go to the side. Woo! It's huge, by the way. If you guys are wondering, this is my face compared to the box. It's a really big box and it's quite heavy. Not too heavy actually, but it's quite heavy. Um, I'm excited. 
Oh my god. Okay. Oh, it just told me that my airpods are nearby. That's fun. Okay, let me... I don't know how to do this. <laughs> I don't have that much space here. Because um, I'm sitting in front of my couch. I'm not actually sitting on my couch. The hair color is wow. Thank you. I've been thinking. So, you know how I get bored of hair? All the, oh, Zuko, you want to see? What's in there, Zuko? What's in there? Um, I've been thinking because I get bored of hair colors a lot. I've been thinking about doing this one ginger next and keeping the brown. But I'll see. I'll see. Anyways, Suka, you want to help me? You want to help me unbox? Let's unbox this. There you go. He's very anxious, so I have to do this very carefully. All right. What do we have here first? We have the... I think this is the t-shirt. Let's check. Yeah, it is. It's the long sleeve. Whoa. I love all the designs. Like I said, I'm a huge, like I'm a, I'm a nerd, and I love Naruto. I'm a big Naruto fan. So this is like my dream. If younger Nikki saw this right now, she would have a heart attack. So you know, just so you guys know how much this means to me. Um, this is the long sleeve, which is really cool. Um, I don't really wear long sleeves. Hi! My cat is adorable. Thank you. He is very sweet. Do you want to take care of them, Zuko? Do you want to take care of the the shirts? Okay, he's going to take care of the shirts. Alright, next we have the browsers. We have some, some shorts here, which have like the little, the little signs which are really cute. And then here they have some, some coordinates. <gasps> Should I type in the coordinates? Wait, if I type in the coordinates to Google Maps, is that gonna work? <clears throat> Let's check. 52.0894 degrees. How do I do the degrees? Uh, degrees I don't know I don't know how to do this chat long press zero thank you degrees oh yeah guys if you want to get them um I think we put it under exclamation mark liquid right chat right 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 exclamation mark liquid should come up with the link or was it exclamation mark naruto we have a chatbot for it can we pin it wait can i pin it no mods can you pin it so if you guys want to get it because it is limited so if you guys want to get any of the stuff Uh, but yeah, I don't know how to do these. They're coordinates though. If you guys want to put in the coordinates, here they are. They're on your butt cheek if you get these. I've always wanted to get like these kind of shorts for working out. Um, so I'm really happy with them. Okay, what do we have next? I think this is the hoodie. It is okay. This hoodie, I already have. Okay, this is a this is a sneak peek that you guys. Um, that I don't even know if I'm allowed to say this, but I already have this hoodie because I went to the liquid facility the other day and I forgot my jacket, so they gave me a hoodie. Um, so I already have this hoodie and I've been wearing it. I've been wearing it so much because I. Can you not scratch my things, May? You're stuck. Sorry, she was scratching my my little chair. This is the hoodie. It has like this 
the liquid horse design on the front and then it has this back design and i think it's really cool and the cool thing about it also is it has like this like bottom design here so yeah i've been wearing this a lot um just so you guys know <laughs> again i don't know if i was supposed to say that <clears throat> Next we have I am so glad to finally have them. I was so excited for them. Oh we have another long sleeve with Itachi and uh, with not Itachi with Sasuke. Why did I say Itachi? With Sasuke and a back. It's so cool! It's so cool, chat! It's so cool. I love it. Have you guys watched Naruto? Have any of you, of you, like, have you guys watched Naruto? Are you guys nerds like me? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad you guys are nerds like me. Hell yeah. If you guys have not seen Naruto, you should watch Naruto. What are, what are you doing? Oh. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> I'm watching it again. Let's go. This is the perfect time then. This is the perfect time for you to get some some Naruto apparel. All right, next. Ooh. Okay, so with this drop, the cool thing is they have some like like basics. They're not none of these are basic, but they have some basics which is like long sleeves and hoodies, but then they have some really cool like like thing like merch things that you don't usually buy as much and if you have seen my merch drop you know i love that i love stuff that is not traditionally merch like i love a good hoodie i love a good t-shirt but i love like things that are more out there things that are more like you know like statement pieces and one thing that they got one of the things the other thing oh my god i cannot wait to show you but the the one thing that they got is this jacket which is like a i think it's a black denim with the liquid design here and then the fox design on the back isn't that so cool oh my god if you guys want to see me try them on by the way i'm gonna post tr a try on tiktok right after like after this i'm gonna film it and then i'm gonna post it so if you guys want to see me try them on go on go to my tiktok but yeah aren't they isn't it so cool it has like a little collar here so cute so cute i love it I love it. <clears throat> Ooh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Next thing. Ooh, okay. If you guys have seen the video uh, of them announcing it and also the pictures that we posted, you saw that I wore this like red Sakura um, knit. They also have that in blue for Sasuke and isn't this so cool okay you might have you might see a theme here with me um and Sasuke that is because it's true um I love Sasuke I'm in love with Sasuke Sasuke he's great so I had to get this as well I had to get this one as well isn't it so cool look at his oh, it's oh I love it oh I love it this is so cool I'm actually so happy with this and then it has like the back but oh my god, it's so cool. Okay, but, 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 the one thing I was most excited about is this. This is the thing I was most excited about. And I'm like, I saw them at the photo shoot and I was so sad that I couldn't try them on because they are so cool. It's the, the trousers. Wait, I'm gonna try and show them to you like fully. Because they're so cool. You must, like, if you see the pictures, look at the people wearing the trousers. They're so cool. But, oh my god, May May's attached to them. They're so, they're a little wrinkly, and especially in the light, but they're so cool. They have, like, the, the little designs here. And they have, like, pockets here. Oh, I don't know if you can see them, like, fully in the, in the stream, but they're, I love them. May, May loves them as well. She keeps being attacked, she keeps attacking them. But yeah, so these are the clothes that I got, that I personally got. We were allowed to, like, um, what is it, like, choose what we wanted. 
And these are basically, I chose the things that I couldn't like try on because I really wanted to try them on because I think they're so cool. Um, and yeah, if you guys want to get them, you should go on exclamation mark Naruto and click on the link. It's um, it's a tracking link. It's not like any, um, you, you don't pay any extra because my name is attached to it, but it's a tracking link and it shows liquid how many people used my link to buy these things and to look at these things so if you guys want to buy something buy it from my link and show them that my community that you guys that um are really dedicated and um so they want to work more with me <laughs> so i can do more things like this like photo shoot i love doing photo shoots photo shoots are so fun i love them um and I love trying out new clothes and I love seeing new clothes and I love Naruto and I do love liquid as well. So uh, <laughs> if you guys only, if you guys are thinking about buying anything, use my link. And if your friends are thinking about bu buying things, if your friends were like, ooh, this looks really cool, then be like, be like, mm, I have this link here. It's, it's tl.gg slash Niachu. <laughs> Remember the Niachu. But yeah. Mm. By the way, the matcha is really good. The the coffee matcha. Anyways, chat. How are we doing? What do you guys think about the clothes? What's your favorite? Maybe not not even the ones that I've looked at. But what's your favorite one um, of the collection? The jack the jacket is so cool. Let me try and get a picture. I can't get anything up on my PC because uh, I don't know how, but I can get a picture up on my phone. <gasps> Did I not tweet that I'm going live? Did I put my Insta? I didn't put my Instagram up either. Wait, so you guys were all here from the notification? That is really sweet. Wait, okay. Who? My heart. Wait, actually. Hi, guys. Thank you for joining the stream. I always thought it was so vital to do the, the Twitter and Instagram announcements, but oh my god! Wait, that just made me really emotional. Thank you for being here, guys. Wait, <laughs> wait, that is so sweet. Thank you, everyone. Oh, oh, oh my God. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the hearts as well. That's crazy. Okay, anyways, I got to continue. <laughs> I can't just sit here. Don't cry. I'm not going to cry. <laughs> oh. Let me, let me try and find the, here it is. So this is the whole apparel. Um, I'm just gonna go through it. We have, we have this jacket as well, which I, I do really like, but I don't think it would suit me. And then we have these. This is the one that I wore. And when we have these, which this is also really cool. I do really like this. And then this one is the one that I wear as well. Ooh. Don't worry, I will look at the I will look at the Discord in a second, guys. Oh no, I don't want to dox anything. Um sorry, I can't I don't want to dox anything. One second. <laughs> one second, guys. Um She loves boxes. Whenever there's a box, she will jump into it. Okay. There we go. Okay, back to back to where we were. Um we have these we have some like keycaps as well, which I really like as well. And then yeah, this one is the one that I wore. 
And then here we have these, which are really cool as well. This one is the hoodie that I've just been wearing. And the skirt, oh my god. It's a skirt that I wore. Um, and then the trousers. They're so cool. Here you can see them like fully. Wait, I want to show you actually people wearing them because I love them. Um, let me see. Emily wore them. So this is Emily. Emily is like the most beautiful person on this planet. Um, and Emily wore those. If you can see it. If you can't, just go on the liquid website. <laughs> they have like the pictures there actually. But I thought I'd show them to you. <laughs> In a way that I could. <laughs> but yeah, they're so cool. Um, anyways, yeah, chat. What, what, what do you like? What, what, are, what, are the, what are the ones that you like? Also, we can just chat now. With the kitties in the background. Is she gone? Yeah, she's gone. <clears throat> yeah, Emily is so pretty. Let me show you Emily's Instagram. Emily. So this is Emily's Instagram. Emily Cosplays. And when I saw her, she gave me her Instagram and I was like, oh, you are so stunning. Look at her. She's so pretty. She's she's so cool as well. Oh, oh, it's so cool. So cool. Look at her. Her name's Emily Ghoul. If you guys want to follow her. And yeah, she's lovely as well. She's so sweet. <clears throat> the blue sweater. Yeah, the blue sweater is so cool. The Sasuke one. It is so cool. Very cool. Zuko is just staring at me right now. Let me see if I can show this to you. Look at him. He's sitting in front of me. Just ignore my, please ignore the, just, <laughs> please just stare. Zuko, you good? Are you good? <laughs> Little baby man. Hello, baby man. Ooh. The chair. Yeah, the chair is cool. The chair came with the apartment. It is very it is very, it is very nice. It is very comfy. I do Is my laptop vibrating? I I do um No, it's not. I do nap in it sometimes cuz it is very comfy. Um, what breed is Zuka? Zuka is a Siberian ragdoll mix. And then May, who's right there, she's a Mancun mix. Her dad's a Mancun, and then her mom's just like some random mouse cat. I don't know what her mom's it, her mom is, but she was like a black brown colored cat. And then she, she's a Mancun mix. Am I in America? No, not yet. Still in the UK right now. May's growing so fast. She's growing so fast. I don't know if you can if you can fully see her. She's huge now. This cat's four months. Four months. <laughs> she's a she's aggressive. She's a feisty one. Grr, grr. She's very playful. She's sleepy right now. Thank you, Lauren. For the sub, I appreciate it. Am I excited for insomnia? Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited to finally see like more of my UK viewers. Cause obviously I've been to like TwitchCon and I've been to VidCon, but they're all in other countries. And I've only ever done like meet and greets and like the Selfridges one and then the Rockstar show. So I'm excited to go to a convention here. It's gonna be cool. My favorite Naruto character, probably Itachi. I do like Itachi. Is that a Lovejoy phone case? It's a Love Lovejoy sticker. Ash gave it to me. Yes, I will be at VidCon. I'm gonna go to VidCon as well.
have I watched Hunter x Hunter or Hunter x Hunter? I started it. I started Hunter x Hunter. Um, but I'm like really like, I, I've just started it. Uh, but I know it's really good. Please don't spoil me. <clears throat> do you think about doing cosplays? I would love to. I wanted to do an Omen cosplay for Insomnia, but because I'm moving, I would have to carry everything around me or like everything with me, so I didn't. But I would love to cosplay at some point. It would be cool. I watched Tokyo Ghoul. Yes, I I actually recently rewatched Tokyo Ghoul. Or actually no, I watched Tokyo Ghoul for the first time recently because I only read the manga. And I do have to say the manga is better, <laughs> but it was good. I did like it. Do I know how to crochet? I do. I would show you my things, but I don't have them here. But I like to crochet when I'm traveling. Like I like to take them on the plane and stuff because it's something to do. Let me like sit closer. There we go. I love how you can only see your eyes. Hello eyes. Oop. <clears throat> Have I seen Alice in Borderland? Only the first season, but I want to watch the second one because I heard the second one is really good. Favorite movie? Um, Your Name. Your Name is my favorite movie. It's great. <clears throat> you bought a crochet frog today? That is so cute. That is so cute. Oh, Automod just denied, like, denied someone for saying Maine Coons are huge, but yes, they are. Um, May is going to get really big. I'm really excited for that, because I, so, when I saw a Toph, um, Zuko would try to play with, um, with, with Toph all the time, but Toph's, like, like, tiny. She's as big as May is now. Um, so he would hurt her because he would play really roughly and he didn't real he wouldn't realize how big he is um, So I wanted to get a bigger cat um, And I also always wanted a Maine Coon, but I wanted to get a bigger cat Especially so that Zuko can play with it with them and May is really playful So they play with each other all the time But then again like May May plays with her claws out and Zuko tells her off all the time um, So I'm hoping that she will um, Realize not to do that um but yeah otherwise they do play with each other like yesterday when i tried to sleep they run around my apartment for two hours straight just back and forth playing with each other and i love i love that i love when i'm just trying to sleep and they run around like lunatics it's great it's so fun that they have to do it right when i'm trying to sleep <clears throat> yeah it's great but then they sleep in my bed zuko always sleeps next to me um, like on my torso and then May either sleeps on her little she has her she has her own little blanket right next to my pillow so she always she either sleeps on that or she sleeps at my feet <clears throat> depending on how she feels I guess but yeah they're so sweet I do love them I love them a lot thank you for the bits Jamie I appreciate it um I've been such an inspiration for many people. There was a time I really needed comfort and you gave it to me without knowing. Oh, thank you so much. I hope you are doing better now. I hope you are doing okay. Am I planning on getting more cats? One day. Right now I'm not because, well, mainly because my, one, I, like, I cannot deal with another, like, getting used to them and having them, like, you know, like getting used to everything because my life is changing so much right now so I can't take in another cat but also um, my apartment that I'm moving into only allows two pets and I think that's probably better because <laughs> I do at some point want another cat Um, I had this dream the other day the other month actually now that I did get another cat it was like a little white a little white ball um, a ball of cat and I, that was really sweet and I was like hmm, maybe I want another cat but um, I think I will only get more pets once I actually have bought 
a place like a house or an apartment because I feel like moving around with them is it's so difficult and I don't want to do it all the time so um, I'm gonna get more if I if I get more pets it will be once I have actually bought a place um, which will be in like years probably <laughs> thank you little piss baby for the 27 months. I Missed appreciate it glad to see you back less than thank three you, thank you so yeah I wish I could put on some music but I haven't really figured out how to do that on this laptop yet I wanted to put them on my airpods and then let it play through my airpods but it didn't work um, and I'm scared that you guys would hear it double, so I, I don't want to try it. I'm sorry that there is no music right now. You could put your own music on in the back. Now you can hear whatever, you, you can listen to whatever you want right now. You don't have to listen to my music. <laughs> I'm, I'm putting Lily Peach on by myself. Let's go. Hey, just put on Lily Peach and pretend it's on the stream. There you go. <laughs> I'm gonna see her boy. Let's try to see. I haven't seen Toph in a long time. Does she not live with you? No, Toph doesn't live with me anymore. Toph was never my cat. She was always my old roommate's cat. So she's back with her old roommate now. <clears throat> mm. I rewatched the dream recently and heard you say you were European when you were joining the member. I honestly thought you were American. I'm not American. I'm German. Everyone always thinks that I'm like either from the UK or I'm American, but I'm not. I'm German. Months. These 18 months have honestly meant so much to me and Thank I can't you, be more grateful for you getting me through them. I appreciate it. I love it. you so much, Nikki, less than 333. Thank you, and also for the 18 months. Thank you. My accent is very light. Yeah, when I, um, when my movers came here, actually, they, they were like, oh yeah, you, so when are you moving? I was like, oh, next week. And they were like, oh, are you going home? And I was like, no, I'm going I'm not. I'm German. <laughs> I'm not going home. What do you mean? I did, however. What I like to do, and I don't know if you guys like to do that as well. I heard I heard from a few people that do. But whenever I go to into Ubers, I um I make up stories. So I don't know why. I just like to like pretend I'm someone else whenever I go into an Uber. And a lot of people do think do think that I'm American <laughs> in Ubers. <laughs> Just because I don't want to tell the same story over and over. Because they'll be like, oh, what do you work as? And I'm like, oh, I do this and that. But I don't want to do that every time. So I just make up stories. I love Dutch, Dutch German language, uh, language, but I'm not going to take the time to learn it. I just think it's a cool language. Understandable. It's a difficult language to learn. <laughs> Thank you, Robo Riot. Hey, Nikki. Wanted to Hello. know if you had any makeup tips as I'm a newbie and find makeup interesting. P.S. Germany is awesome. Thank you. Any tips? I don't know, like, um, I'm, I'm trying to think if there's, like, any tips that I haven't said yet. Um, I don't know. I think one thing that people always think um, with makeup is like there has to be one way to to do it and I think that is so wrong like makeup I, I personally see makeup as a form of art and I love doing it I, I use makeup to express myself and I use makeup to express myself creatively um, obviously not on my day-to-day -day makeup I just put on my day-to-day -to -day makeup to like look oh like look the way they do but um w like with makeup i think one thing is like don't be too hard on yourself especially when you are a newbie like 
there is no way like no one way to do makeup and um yeah i don't know i think that is one thing like don't be too hard on yourself don't let people discourage you because people will like especially the internet will always try to find a way to, to put you down and if you are new at something um i don't know why i don't know why the internet does it but they you know if you're new at something they like to make sure you will never try that thing ever again and you will feel so insecure about it and you will not like to do that thing anymore but don't let yourself get discouraged from it like at the end of the day it's your face and you can do whatever you want with your face um so yeah don't get discouraged by people don't take it too serious um if you want to get like better at it consume content about it there's a lot of like really good makeup artists out there who will give you tips and who will um like carry you through like a routine um and then again there's like a lot of different makeup artists as well who have different skin colors different skin textures different like ways they apply makeup different makeup styles like there's all of that thing uh, like all of those things out there and it's such a big world and i think if you like start consuming that and you will realize like what kind of makeup you like on your face like it'll come with time you know if you if you just keep at it don't stress yourself about it then it'll it'll come with time i've been doing my makeup since i was like nine years old i was like a little emo kid like doing my eyeliner really big and listening to people screaming while doing it you know being angry and that was fun and that kind of developed into what i do now which is like my eyeliner and you know <laughs> like it, it very much evolves and if you try new things and if you realize what you like it'll it'll come with time if that makes sense <laughs> Am I going to Gamescom in Germany? I'll try. I will. Um, I would love to, but I don't know what exact time it is, and I don't know if I'm busy around that time. So if I'm not busy, I probably will go. <laughs> Did Walter just eyeliner? Yeah. That emo nest still holds up. You guys want to see an old picture of me? I posted this before or like maybe I can find another one maybe I can find one that I didn't post before let me see if I can see some if I can find some spicy old pictures I just need to scroll up like all the way <laughs> let's see um let's see if I can find one <laughs> wait did i show this one to you before wait honestly this one isn't too bad this one is like pretty like i haven't changed that much <laughs> wait <laughs> wait a second i was like 12 <laughs> um and then I have this one, which is like when I tried to when I tried out eyeliner, like like the pointy eyeliner. And then I have <laughs> I have this one, which okay I used to post like if you see like this, these are screenshots of my old Instagram. I used to post only in black and white. I used to <laughs> I used to post pictures only in black and white, and so this was me. <laughs> When was this? Can I see that? In 2016. This was me in 2016. Um, another 2016. Beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, <laughs> what else do I have? Do I have any others? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, this one. I used to have... Um, blue hair for like the longest time i had blue hair for like two years i think um 
So yeah, that's fun. <laughs> Just trying to see. There's a lot of pictures with like my friends. I don't want to dox them, of course. Um, trying to see if I have anything else. Oh yeah, so this is the first picture I ever took. This is the first selfie I have ever taken. I posted this one before, but this is the first selfie I've ever taken. I must have been like nine years old or ten years old at that point. <laughs> Let's see if I can find any others. <clears throat> Tumblr core? Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure I posted this one on Tumblr as well. No, actually, I must have not. I posted it on Instagram. I didn't really like fully use Tumblr at that point. Um, I did use Tumblr, but I didn't post myself, so I posted it on um, Instagram back then. Um, oh my god, this is me in my fanatic, fanatic jersey. You can see like the colors in there. I used to be a huge fanatic fan um, when I was younger. I used to go to all their games uh, in League of Legends. Um, this one I just dyed my hair blue again. This is like less makeup. This is me cosplaying as Annie because I had red hair and I was like, oh my god, I look like Annie. This is the only picture I took with red hair because I hated it. I hated my red hair. This is me. This does not look like me, but this is me. I used to love this picture. I used to have this picture as my profile picture everywhere. I thought I looked so cool and cute in this picture. I had it, I had it everywhere. <laughs> um, this was like right before the, the Rose concert. I went to a the Rose concert and I loved it. It was great. I'm just I'm just showing you my like camera roll now. <laughs> Guys, I'm a I'm your Tinder date. I just took you home and now we're sitting here and I'm showing you my camera roll because that's what I do. Yeah. This is this is a really cute picture of me as well. I look so young in it. That was when I had brown hair. It's kind of like this one now actually. It's kind of like that. Not the Tinder date. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh my god. This hairstyle. I only ever got my hair to look like that once. Like the space buns. I only got to do that. Like got that once. And they looked so cute. And I wore them for a whole day and I was really sad when I had to take them out because I really liked them. <laughs> oh my god, this is really embarrassing. This is so okay. Okay, you know how I how I was really edgy and cool and cool back then? Like I was really edgy. Um <laughs> I took this. <laughs> I feel like this is something you'd find on like Pinterest back in 2012. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's so funny. <laughs> oh, here's a picture of my dog when we just got her. This is Sira when she was a baby. She was always quite chubby. You know what? I always, whenever I see an Akita, I'm like, Sira doesn't look like that. She's a lot bigger, but like fat. Um, she was always chubby. That's just her, I guess. I, I should stop fat shaming my dog because <laughs> she was always like that. No, I'm not fat shaming her, but she is very heavy. She's like 45, 48 kilos, which is a lot. <clears throat> Mm. 
She looks sweet. She's the sweetest. She's really sweet. I love her. She's getting really old now. Oh! She's gone. She's hiding. Where is she? There she is! Oh, no, 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 no. I have these blankets here so they don't scratch the the couch because it's um, leather. <clears throat> She's taking care of the chat now. What else do I have? Oh, this is when I first had split dye hair. It is kind of the hair I have right now. This is when I first split dyed my hair. It was brown and 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 blonde. And it's kind of how I had it now. Good luck with your new move. Thank you, Jenna. Thank you, thank you. I'm excited. That's crazy. <clears throat> Okay, I'll stop now. This is my this is my pictures. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> hope you enjoyed my pictures, guys. <clears throat> you look so cool there. I don't look cool now. <laughs> You're like, oh, you were so cool back then. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. Let me check what time that was. What year was that? What year was I cool? 2018. Ever since then, everything went downhill. Now I have um, weird hair that doesn't want to look fine. <laughs> that just looks like this. Okay. <laughs> Got cooler every year. Thank you. <laughs> I think I just grew up. <laughs> but I'm still the same person, you know? That's the thing, like... When people are like, oh, you changed. It's like, no, I didn't. <laughs> I really did not. I've always been like this. This has always been me. Right, May? <laughs> Little eyes. They're so cute. <laughs> um, do I dye my own hair? I didn't. Well, I kind of did this one. I did this one when I dyed it the first time, but then to refresh it, I went to a hairdresser. I don't bleach my own hair, never. I did it during lockdown because that was the only option, but I don't bleach my hair normally. I always go to a hairdresser. Um, but color, color I do myself. We have the same couch, really? This couch was in my apartment before. Um, it's not mine. That's so cool, though. <clears throat> How many different hair dyes have I done so far? <sighs> you want me to count? I, I'll expl I'll tell you. So my first hair color, so my, my natural hair color was blonde. First time I dyed it was black. Then it was orange. Then it was blue, and I had blue for a while. And it kept, like, fading to, like, green and purple. So I do count green and purple. Um... Then I had it white, then I had it red, and then I went back to blonde for a while. And then I had it pink for a little bit, I had like the ends pink. And then I dyed it back to blue, um, and then I dyed it to brown, and I had brown for quite a while. And I think after that I got my split dye hair, so the brown and and um and blonde and then i went black and pink and then i had black and pink for a while and then i dyed it back to blonde i like a strawberry blonde and i washed out to normal blonde and then i had it blonde for a while and then it's everything you saw me from streaming on so like the lover host actually the lover host i think was right when i switched back to blonde um yeah after that i had everything you know now <clears throat> so yeah but i am lucky that my hair color like my natural hair color is quite like light obviously it has a big contrast to the to the blonde that i have right now but it is quite light so whenever i bleach my hair i only have to bleach it like once and it's like white which is really good Ba -da -ba -da -ba. 
Ba da da da. <clears throat> How old is May today? She's like three months now. Am I gonna get another piercing soon? Mm, I don't know. I haven't really thought about it. I, I, I don't know. Right now I don't. Right now I'm not. Especially because these ones were so annoying to heal. Because they didn't like give me any issues or anything, but they were just, I just felt them constantly. And um, because of that, like I, again, I do still love them and I don't regret them, but they do, they did annoy me. And because of that, I think <laughs> right now I don't want to have another one. How old is Zuko? Zuko's two and a half years. No. Well, he's two and seven months. Maybe eight months now. Two and seven or eight months. So he's quite he's getting old. No, he's not. Where is he? Where's Zuko, me? Where is he? She's looking that way, so I'm guessing he's that way. <clears throat> He's gonna be in his prime. He's always been in his prime. He's never left his prime. He is a baby. He is always gonna be a baby. He can be um, 100 because he is going to turn 100. Um, he's not gonna die before me. Um, and he will still be a baby. I'm so excited to see the video with you and Sam and, Sam and Colby. I am as well. I want to see it. I want to watch it now. It's, I actually, um, I haven't watched the video with um, Carl and Foolish yet because I wanted to watch it with you guys. So once I am in America and I have a PC and a whole setup, I'm going to do a like watch a watch party of that video and the Sorry Boys video. I haven't watched that one yet either. There, there are a few videos that I, I haven't watched um, intentionally because I want to watch it with you guys so yeah and obviously the seven copy video with me and G is going to be on that list as well I'm not going to watch um it's gonna be really hard but I'm not going to watch it before I watch it with you guys Do your cats get along? I want to get another cat, but I'm curious about what if they don't get along. So, it's really funny. Hey. It's really funny because um, when I got her, she... I, I left her in the room and I like did everything that they needed to do to like get used to each other. And Zuko... Z so Zuko is a really anxious cat. And he never fully cared about her like he was scared at first he was scared of her at first and he didn't like her for like a, the first day hey i'm talking rude um <laughs> he was yeah he was scared of her first for like a day and then they started to like what is this oh <laughs> okay i see it just tells me what to do it, it's like the sponsor thing um but yeah, uh, sorry, I got distracted. Um, <laughs> so yeah, Zuko was scared at first. And then he, he, they started to like sniff each other. And then um, they started to lay next to each other um, in my bed. Because she whenever I go to bed, she goes to bed. And he loves laying in my bed with me. So whenever she would lay there, he would just lay there with her and like kind of tolerate her. And then... They got closer and closer and would like sleep next to each other and would play with each other would sniff each other all the time um but also just leave each other alone when they needed to be alone um and now that she is becoming like because she's growing right and she's kind of like in the age where she's trying to test her limits and Luke, zuko did that when he was younger as well he tries to test his limits and she tries to test her limits where it's like how far can I push them? How far can I go until I get into trouble? Um, and because of that, she keeps like jumping on him and she keeps like biting him. And she does the same with me. She keeps, she keeps she's a nightmare right now. Um, and so Zuko does tell her off a lot. Like he, 
he hit, like he doesn't he isn't mean he is not angry he doesn't hit her he doesn't hurt her he just hisses at her and tells her off but she needs that she needs to be told off because she is trying to test her limits um so that's what's going on right now but they, they they're fine with each other but zuko is a very good cat like zuko has never never ever attacked me He's never hissed at me. No, he's hissed at me a few times, but he's never growled at me. He's hissed at me, like, when he gets an, uh, overwhelmed because he is a really anxious cat, he starts hissing. But he's never, like... N- like, when he when he's scared, he runs away. He doesn't attack. Never. I tr- whenever I tried to put him in the carrier, because that, that used to be a really big thing for him. He used to get really scared to get into the carrier for, like, the doctor's appointment and stuff. He once once tried to turn around and hit me he turned around and realized what he was doing and stopped and then let himself get put into the carrier because he felt so bad so he like Zuko is a really friendly cat and he would never do anything to anyone um and so yeah that's like his his personality and because of that I think he like that's why he's fine with her because he's just fine um, but Toph did hate her. Toph hated May. Toph would like constantly like growl at her. May could not go near her, like nothing. Um, so yeah, that was kind of that. But, which I think also a really big thing is because she's a girl, and like girl cats probably get along less than a boy and a girl. <clears throat> so yeah. Did I have pets when I grew up? Yes. I've always had pets. There was no like period in my life except for when I lived alone in Berlin where I didn't have any pets. And even in Berlin, I always thought about getting pets. Um, I just didn't have the money. So yeah, I grew up with dogs. I, drew up, I grew up with cats. I had bunnies for a while. I had emus for a while. Um, and then, yeah, again, just dogs and cats. My brother has like snakes and turtles and like different reptiles and fish. We, yeah, I used to have emus. The Australians, the Australians are gonna be like, what the fuck? But in Spain, um, emus are quite common, especially on Mallorca. Um, they're quite common. <laughs> so yeah, we used to have, we had, we had two emus. Their names were Frida and Karl Heinz. Very German. Um, that was their names. And they loved to eat uh, bread mixed with water. And they loved to run around in like, like, uh, water like we would spray like water on them <laughs> not in Madrid yeah maybe just in Spain maybe it's just a, 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 a Mallorca I mean maybe it's just a Mallorca thing but yeah we had um, we had two emus as an Australian I'm very confused I know I told Australians before like a few weeks ago and they were like but they're so mean and I was like no they're not like you know the guy on YouTube who keeps hitting his like emu it's because he keeps hitting him that's why the emu is aggressive they're actually like really friendly birds well maybe not in Australia but ours were really friendly (laughs) so yeah I met some emus in Mallorca and they were very cute. Yeah, maybe the Mallorquin um, emus are just nice. (laughs) Maybe it's just the Mallorquin emus. Maybe the other ones are not. Karl Heinz is iconic. Honestly, they were iconic. They were great. We were hoping that they would lay eggs, but they never have. (laughs) They just didn't want to lay any eggs. Maybe they were too young, to be honest. What am I drinking? I'm drinking boba. It's like a matcha coffee. <coughs> God, my... <coughs> I got... I got boba in my wrong throat. You can't, your grandfather's name is Karl Heinz? Let's go! It's a very German name. Like a very old German name. Love the phone case. Thank you. I'm reading chat, by the way. I'm not just scrolling on my phone. I have my chat. I have you guys on my phone. That's what I'm doing. (laughs) Just so you guys know. I'm not just like 
ignoring you guys you know i know we're having a conversation here <clears throat> so yeah don't worry let me there we go i'm planning on getting a siberian cat what's your advice on them they're great so i don't know if zuku is more ragdoll or more siberian because he looks more like a siberian cat 100 percent um and i can, but i can't like let me google let me google what siberian cats like natures are um siberian cat personality let's see <clears throat> siberian cats are very personable and want to be near their owners which is very true he's not here right now i don't know why but he usually is always with me um probably not probably because i'm never in this room like the, i'm never in my living room so he's like what is going on and also i put the heater on in my bedroom so he's probably in the bedroom because it's warmer there and um, they enjoy the company of children dogs and other animals they're fearless and easygoing that's a lie <laughs> zuko is not he is not fearless at all he's the opposite of fearless zuko is the comp which also might also might be because of the way i rescued him so zuko um before he came to me was in a family where he um they had a child and the child didn't know he was he was autistic and he was quite autistic so he didn't really understand the concept of an animal and a cat and he didn't really know he was really young as well and he didn't know how to like take care of a cat so he would pull his tail he would punch him he would basically abuse him and because of that i think he is really scared i think that made him really scared but i think yeah probably like their nature is probably like they're probably fearless i can see that because they are like if you can if you want to look at siberians they're like big cats you know they're like wild cats um and so yeah they like to be near owners which is true yeah i know he he wasn't treated very well but here he is he's being he's being babied and spoiled here um and i've never i've never heard this cat in my life I probably once stepped on his tail and apologized a thousand times. <laughs> That's probably the most, the most um, I've done. And I would never, I would never hurt this cat in my life. Actually not. <laughs> um, so yeah. Mm-mm. <clears throat> crazy that the family didn't stop that that's why they gave him away and they gave him away at a really young age so they got him they probably had him for a week and then realized they can't keep him so they gave him away um because i got him when he was a baby like i got him when he was tiny let me let me see if i can find a picture of when i got him like he was he was a tiny baby um so yeah they did give they they did like stop it as much as i could um it was the same with um, my mom's, one of my mom's ex-boyfriends had a child, quite a young son, who also didn't understand the concept of another, like, like being, um, and he would pull the, our dog's tail, um, and like, punch her, and just be really nasty to her, and my mom got angry at him really angry um and like made him stop like she didn't like obviously like put her hands on him at all but she she got really angry and made him like realize that you don't do that um and i think that's why i think i think it's really important for children to grow up with animals because they learn you know they learn this was zuko when i just got him like a really tiny baby. <laughs> um, here. Um, yeah, they learn that to take care of another, like, like an animal, and um, to be responsible and to not like hurt them. I think. So I personally, if I ever have a child, definitely want, would want that child to grow up with another animal 
not another animal. Children are not animals, guys. Oh god, that, that was wrong. That was wrong. Just an animal. <laughs> not another animal. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> the true colors of Nikki Nancy <laughs> um but yeah <laughs> that's that's that um <laughs> that's what I think um and then May I got May from a family who they just had two cats and the cat like like turned out to be pregnant and their house like their apartment it wasn't a house it was like quite a small apartment um was too small to have kittens so they just gave those away that's where i got that's where i got this baby this little baby she was never she was never abused i only like twice accidentally stepped on her in the middle of the night because she's so dark and she loves to go in front of my feet and then i feel really bad and she doesn't care and that's i don't know if i should feel worse because she just doesn't care but i don't think so she just doesn't care about anything this the last time when we went to the vet and she got her um microchip she um she fell asleep in the carrier like on the way home she just fell asleep and i've never seen a cat that fell asleep on a car ride Usually my cats have always like been really anxious and like screaming during car rides. She just fell asleep. <laughs> she just doesn't care. <laughs> What's my favorite animal? Elephants. Elephants are my favorite animal. I love them. They're so cute. They're so funny. Any advice on learning German? I mean, um, with like any language, I think the best practice is talking, speaking German. So if you have any German friends, speak German to them. Or if you watch any like movies or TV shows, watch them in German. Um, that's one thing that is like I find really helpful with learning new languages, even if it's like awkward at first. Elephants are so underrated. I agree. Everyone, whenever I tell them, people are like, why elephants? And I'm like, have you seen them? Bro. Elephant. Oh, I wrote it wrong. Elephant. Have you seen these guys? Aren't they the coolest, the coolest things ever? Look at them. Look at this guy. Look at this boy. He's so cool. I love him. Thank you, uh, Reagan, love you, for the Nikki. sub for the two months. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Oh my god, I just looked at the sub goal. We're like over the goal. I appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Thank you for all the subs today. Thank you. Oh, one thing I want to do. I'm actually going to tell you, tell you this now. I didn't want to tell you yet because I was like, because um, I can't do it while I'm on my laptop. But because I want to stream more and I want to stream longer, I thought what I'm going to do is I'm going to do like mini subathons whenever I go live on my like setup, once I have my setup. So I'm going to have a timer in the corner, which is going to be, um, which is going to fill up when you sub. But I'm not going to do it like, you know, I'm not going to just do a subathon every single time, but I'm just going to stream for longer. So the more people sub, the longer I will be streaming. I just thought that would be like pretty cool because <clears throat> I don't want to do subathons. I just want to stream longer and I feel like that's actually like a cool way to do it. I don't know. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks chat. I thought it was a good idea. <laughs> I'm glad you guys think so as well. <laughs> so yeah, um, I think, I think, um, I counted and I usually get around like 50 subs a stream like on average I think um, and I thought like I'm gonna put the goal to a hundred and usually I don't reach a hundred but I think a hundred would be 10 hours and 10 hours is an okay time to stream especially when, when I stream during the daytime 
Um, so yeah. I think that would be pretty cool. So 50 subs are 5 hours. That's already good, quite a lot. <clears throat> My parents left me in the IKEA parking lot. Are you okay? I, I, I don't know. I don't know what to go back inside. I think. Call them. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, it's in the Q QSMP. I have. It's really cool. I'm very proud of him. Very cool. Do I have a favorite dinosaur? The one with the long neck. I don't know what they're called, but I like those. Have I ever played The Last of Us? The Last of Us is my favorite game. I actually played The Last of Us nine times. And one of those times was on stream. And half of those times was on YouTube. I have played The Last of Us. I love The Last of Us. Yes, yeah, the Stegosaurus. Stegos Stegos I don't know if, it, that, if it's that in English, but it's that one. Ooh, I also have a new list. So, okay, I don't know if this is a weird me thing, but one thing, <laughs> I don't know how to say this because I feel like this sounds weird, but one thing that really relaxes me is planning. Spreadsheets are my guilty pleasure. I love doing spreadsheets. I love like doing my little schedule. Like this is my calendar. <laughs> Wait, let me show you my calendar. This is my calendar. This and it always looks like that. Like this is my next month. Like I love doing planning. Um and so I love doing spreadsheets. And whenever I'm stressed, I've been really stressed for the last like month because of this move. This move has like really, really stressed me out. And what I've been doing is I've just been doing little spreadsheets. I just, I just, I've just been spreadsheeting. Um, so sometimes I sit on my spreadsheet for one day and I just, I just plan. This is my, this is my UK spreadsheet. This is my UK spreadsheet. And then I started my US spreadsheet. It's my US spreadsheet. And <laughs> on that spreadsheet, I already have um, like written out all the story games I want to play. Um, I'm the same Nikki plus journals. I need to start journaling. I need to start journaling. I really want to start journaling because I feel like it'll, it'll relax me as well. But I started doing a list of all the games I want to play on Nimki. Um, and I have... On, I actually, oh, I actually did a list of like things I want to do on Nietzsche and that's Nietzsche as well. Well, I didn't even know that. Um, but I have like written down like the current game I'm playing, which is The Walking Dead, like the series. And then I have the next ones, which is the all the Resident Evil games because the new Resident Evil just came out and I want to play that. But I figured I should play the other ones before that because um, I only played, I only ever played one Resident Evil game. And I might also start Genshin Impact. Um, which is just gonna be like a game I can play here and there um, and then I have all the single games like the, the games that aren't series written down those are these ones and then I have the multiple games the game series down here and I love it and I think it's really cool and I am excited to go through that list because now I have a list and I love it <laughs> and I love ticking up ticking the little boxes of like I've done this <laughs> you know so once um once I'm back on my um setup I'm going to do longer um story game uh story game streams as well um where I'm just gonna stream for like hours and play the games yay <laughs> yay what's the app called it's spreadsheets um it's sheets on 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 here on google uh, on on iphone i just say google it's pretty it's cheats on google but it's um it's like a chrome app so if you have google chrome if you have a google a google chrome um profile then you should have like docs and sheets and whatever they also have whatever whatever else they have is the walking dead coming back soon yes as soon as i have a setup again i will play the walking dead again So 
Is my lock screen photo? It's Zuko. And Zuko holding out his, like, showing his tongue. And then I have, I have multiple lock screens. I have Zuko. And then I have Mei and Zuko. And then I have a fan art. And another fan art. And then I have Mei. These are all my, my lock screens. That's the one I currently have. But I switch them up all the time. This is my, I love this fan art. Isn't this so cool? I forgot who made it. I'm so sorry that I forgot. But it's so nice. Ooh. And you can see how like bad my phone case is. I need to get, I don't know. I want to get something like, I was thinking about like one of those machines where you put your phone in and it just like, it, it like sanitizes your phone. But I think I just need to like get like phone wipes and like clean my phone because I don't do it and it's so bad because I touch my face I touch my phone then I touch my face <clears throat> which is so bad my favorite Resident Evil game is Resident Evil Village see I only ever played which one did I play? I played it on stream the one the one before the last one the one before this one no not the one with the woman the one before the woman i played that one biohazard i only ever played biohazard and because of that i, I want to play the whole series again i think i already have all of them on steam because uh, i bought a uh, bought a bundle once um so i'm gonna i'm gonna play those next I think but there are also some single player games that I really want to play let me open my spreadsheets again um, <clears throat> there are some really nice single game I've, I've never played and I've since I started streaming even before the lover host when people would come into my chat they recommended me what remains of Edith Finch and I've never played it and I heard it's really good um, so I might want to play that should I put you up there chat I think I'm gonna move you guys so, I, so you can see yourselves better Look, that's like a lot better. There we go. Um, I really want to play that one. And then I've played Franbo before, but I, I, I get a lot of people asking me to play Franbo and it's been a few years, so I might play Franbo again. Um, should I just read you the list? I just read you the list. Um, so the single player games that I want to play next are Murder at Soul Suspect, which has been also been years since I played that, uh, What Remains of Edith Finch, Contrast, Franbo, Subnautica Below Zero, maybe, that's a big maybe, I don't know if I want to play that yet, um, Grease, Firewatch, Half-Life Alex, The Wolf Among Us, Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons, The Whispered World, I think The Whispered World might be a series, I'm not too sure, um, Tell Me Why, Twin Mirror, Dying Light, Spiritfarer, Call of the Sea, Bioshock. Oh, Bioshock, Bioshock also is a series. Sorry, I, I did that while I was sleep deprived. <laughs> um, and We Happy, We Happy Few, which I, honestly, I saw. So We Happy Few, that's really funny, because I saw um a video essay about it, how like buggy the game is and how laggy it is but they explained the story and the story looked really cool so i thought like maybe i can look over the box and play the game anyways so i might do that and then the multiplayer games are the alice games so alice madness returns and hopefully the one before that if i get it to work i looked for hours to get it but it isn't available in the eu or at least in, in the uk so i might once i'm in america try and get it um, the Deponia games, oh, which are so cute. It's like a point and click series and I love it. Do we have a, do we have a heart spam? <gasps> Thank you for the heart spam. Thank you for the heart spam. We got all the hearts here. It's so cute. I love it. I'm so happy about this, em like, emoji thing. I'm so happy I got it to work because it's so cute. You just have little hearts on my screen. I love it. I love it. Um... See, so yeah, I'm gonna play the Alice games, uh, the Pony, the Deponia games, which I think it's my, made by a German um, developer. And if you guys saw my um, Ed Nine Harvey series, it's similar to that. It's like the same kind of game. Um, then the Dark Pictures games I want to play. 
the Satinov's Chains games, which is also um, a point and click. Um, Kingdom Hearts, Final Fantasy, Mass Effect, and then Bendy and the Ink, Ink Machine and Revival, because I've never played those, actually. Thank you, Leah Bell, for the sub. I appreciate it. Um, I've never played Bendy and the Ink Machine. Um, Plague Tale, uh, the Plague Tale game, sorry, the Plague Tale games. Um, then the old Legend of Zelda, like the 64 games, the Nintendo 64 games, because um, my favorite one is Majora's Mask, and I kind of want to play replay all of those. I've never played, well, I've only played Twilight Princess, Majora's Mask, and one more. So I want to play those. It's been years. It's like I was really young when I played those. Um, Little Nightmares and then Orion, the Orient the Blind Forest games, which are more chill. I feel like the Orient the Blind Forest games are more like a background game. But yeah, I want to play those. Those are the games that I want to play. Those are on my list. If you guys have any recommendations, let me know. You love the RE games? Yeah, I've played them. I played the first game for a little bit, but then I got stuck and I got frustrated and I stopped. And I feel like it's such a cute story. So I will try it again. <laughs> I will try it on stream this time. So I have to play it. <clears throat> but yeah, I think the... Um, the thing I'm most excited about, no, one of the things I'm most excited about are the King Kingdom Hearts games, because I haven't played the few recent ones, but um, I always really like Kingdom Hearts, and I think you guys will as well. I think it'll be like one of the game series that you guys are really gonna like. So yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm excited for that. Slime Rancher 1 and 2. Does Slime Rancher actually have a story? Because I heard a few people want me to play Slime Rancher. Does it have a story? It's just very cute and chill. Yes. It does? <gasps> oh my god. Maybe I'll play Slime Rancher as well then. Let me put it on the list. I have already played Stray. I would play Stray. But I've already played Stray. Stray. Slime Rancher. I think next after Resident Evil so I think what I'm gonna do I probably go between a series and then one game and then a series and then one game so after Resident Evil I probably play Murder at Soul Suspect because it's a good game it's, it's one of those like like a uh, heavy rain type of games Sally Face. Ooh. I've I've actually never played Sally Face on stream, have I? Oh my god. That's a really good I played the first episode off stream. Oh my god. Yeah, we'll play Sally Face. I've already played Unpacking. I wish they would bring out another game like Unpacking. I really liked Unpacking. Unpacking was cool. What about Omori? Ooh, I think Omori was on my Steam list. But isn't Omori, like, really dark? I say that as if I haven't played, like, Heavy Rain. <laughs> I say that as if I haven't been playing really dark games. <laughs> Did the audio get weird? Did it? Did the audio just get weird? No, okay. I guess it's on your side then. I'm sorry. Stardew Valley. I love Stardew Valley. I used to play Stardew Valley quite a lot on stream. And then I played it off stream. So I had... Thank you, Simba, for the prime. I appreciate it. I had... When I started playing Stardew Valley, I think I played it for the first time on stream, right, chat? And then I developed like a huge hyper obsession with it like i hyper fixation i i would watch stardew valley while playing stardew valley and then i would think about stardew valley and dream about stardew valley and everything i did was just stardew valley for like months like three months probably um and now i know everything about the game <laughs> but i've never finished the community center because before i did it i stopped playing it but i would really love to play stardew valley again but i'm scared that I'm gonna get addicted to it again. Stardew Valley is one of those games that I will get addicted to. It's the same with Sims. Um, 
whenever a new sims expansion pack comes out i just play sims um i probably i probably added like 50 hours to my sims not not 50 like 30 i probably added like 30 game hour like played hours to my sims like played hours ever since the new expansion pack came out it's my guilty pleasure <laughs> and i'm scared that it will happen with uh, with stardew valley as well once i start again because i can't have two i can have one hyper like hyper fixation and game that i just constantly play but i can't have two what am i gonna do with my life <laughs> you know Thank you so much, Nick. I feel like you have enough games on there to stream till you're 30 lol. Looks like you won't be short on content for Nineki for a long, long, long time. I won't. Makes my head explode with how much you have planned. Should be a fun time. I have a lot planned for Neochu as well, but I don't want to say anything for Neochu yet because I don't want to give empty promises. Like Nimki, I know I will play those games on and I know I will play it longer on because I will be able to. Because I won't just stream when I'm tired. Um, but with Neochu, I feel like I don't want to promise anything that I can't keep. But I will do cooking streams. Cooking streams are coming back and they are going to be m more frequent. Because I'm going to start meal prepping and I'm going to have a kitchen where I can like, like stream really well in. Well, in my new apartment. And that'll be really exciting. <clears throat> Yay! I just start playing more horror games. I would love to, but I don't know what are some good horror games right now. I I feel like I've played like the good ones, you know. I played Alien Isolation. I played um, the both of the um, what are they called? Layers of Fear. I even played the DLC. Minecraft? Minecraft is the biggest horror game, you're so right. <clears throat> I love Layers of Fear. Layers of Fear, I think, is my favorite horror game. When's the next stream with the girlies? So, I think they have planned something, but because I don't have a setup, I sadly can't do any stream with, streams with them right now. But, they'll happen. The girlies streams are still here and they're they're gonna happen, don't worry. We are all really excited. Like the girl like now that you've brought it up, we are really excited about this because um it like it's really hard to kind of find your group and especially as a girl, you know, in this in this scene it's really hard to find your group and people who are excited to play with you and i feel like with the girlies we're all equally as excited to play with each other and it's just really nice and really wholesome so um um yeah once i'm back on my setup we will do lots of things with the girlies definitely phasmophobia i love phasmophobia phasmophobia is so fun i want to do more phasmophobia streams and i think the girlies do as well <clears throat> Who are all of the girlies? Let me look at the group chat. The group chat has has grown. Um So, the girlies right now are G, Lexi, me, Olive, Shelby, and then Rambu is also in the group chat because we played Phasmophobia with him. Um, he hasn't really said much, but I think he, I think we can count him as one of the girlies. Rambu is one of the girlies as well. I want to see Nikki do some VR horror games. I was thinking about doing VR FNAF, but I can't even do normal FNAF chat. I tried <laughs> multiple times, but I can't even do normal FNAF. It's so scary. 
but um, I think we'll slowly get there. I think I'll start with Half-Life Alex, and then maybe, you know, maybe some Phasmophobia. I would love to do some Phasmophobia VR. Um, yeah, it'll, it'll be fine. It'll be fun. It, it'll be content. Fine. So fine. What one, which one of the piercings hurt the most you get? I don't know. None of them really hurt. Like, you can definitely feel them. Probably this, no. Yes, this nostril. My left nostril, this is left for me. My left nostril hurt, probably hurt the most because um, she had to re-pierce it. She had to do it twice and that hurt the second time. But they weren't really like bad. The healing process was worse. It's the same with tattoos. I feel like everyone's always like, oh, how much did your tattoo hurt? But it's like the aftercare hurts. Like, it doesn't hurt, but it's more annoying because it starts itching. And that's the worst part. And then with piercings, it starts like, it's like, first it's like throbbing because it's like your blood goes there because it's a wound. Um, and then just cleaning it and like, having your skin and your face get used to it it's kind of annoying but you get used to it at some point you won't feel it anymore actually taking it out is like weirder because like if it's not in there my body is now like what the hell where where did it go what is going on where like there there's it's supposed to be there now so it's a part of me now let me see if i can get it in now oh god oh god i might need a mirror no, I got it. Thank you, Lola, for the sub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, this ha like these haven't get gotten used to it yet. My body is still not used to these ones, but once I am, like it'll be good. It'll be fine. <clears throat> do you have a Nintendo Switch? I do. Thank you for the bits. Royal Rabbit, I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Do I have a belly piercing? I don't. I do not have a belly piercing. My mom used to have one. My mom used to have a belly piercing when she was younger, probably my age. She took it out after she gave birth to me. Um, I don't really know why. I thought it was quite cool. But, yeah. Okay, chat. I think <gasps> Sina. Thank you so Love much. Love the eyeliner. Less than three. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm actually going to go ahead and raid someone now. I think. Let me quickly see who's live. Ooh. Um. <gasps> Ooh. Should we raid Jonas? Looking forward to seeing you next week. I hope yeah, you'll have space to take too. gifts back with you to LA. By the way, Nikki, yes, I, I do a lot of your last Nimeki stream. Would you be able to publish the VOD so I can see what I missed? I don't know if I can. Thanks. I can Take try, care, Nikki. but I'm not logged into it right now. But I can try and publish it, yes. Um, yes, and I don't have space in my suitcase. I'm going to take a big suitcase with me that's empty. So if you guys are want to give me anything for uh, insomnia next week, next weekend, um, you very much can. Everyone's saying Hannah. Should we read Hannah then? Okay, let's write Hannah. Wait, ooh, ooh, ooh. I, I need to get used to this this laptop. Um, let me let me go on here. Yes, and then I can mute my stream. Go to my chat. All right, all right. I got it. I got it. I got it. Raid. Raid. No. Raid. Hannah. Sex. Rose. Okay, chat. Thank you so much for being here. I know this was just like a, a sh just chatting stream, but I'm gonna do more of these um, now during the move because I don't have a setup. I hope you guys are enjoying them. I hope you guys are liking them. Um, also, thank you for being here. Even though I didn't announce these on my social medias, this is gonna make me cry. I'm gonna think about this, I'm telling you tonight and be like, I'm so grateful. Oh my God, you guys are so sweet because I really appreciate it. It's very sweet and crazy and um, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for watching as well. And I hope you guys... Is it going through? Oh, it's not going through. Wait. 
Ana. Ah. No. There it is. There it is. All right, chat. I hope you all are having a wonderful morning, evening, or day, wherever you are. And go ahead and give Hannah some of my love. Remember, I'm posting a TikTok, probably like an hour, um, where I try on all these clothes, all of the cool clothes. Um, so go ahead and watch that if you want to see me try them out. Um, and yeah, otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.